All right, so you all know Snoop Dogg is making five hundred thousand dollars a day. Dog, Ooh, is that true? It, it was from, from Buddy some and from NBC reporting it. So I'm I'm assuming yes. Dude, five hundred thousand for a what? day? Like what? He ain't doing that much. Maybe, My man is the USA mascot. <laughs> but maybe he's drawing in uh, potential people that wouldn't be watching the Olympics. Now they're paying attention. No. <laughs> Why? Absolutely I don't not. think anybody's watching the Olympics because of Snoop Dogg. I mean, maybe they'll check it out. There's nobody watching the Olympics because of Snoop Dogg. The Olympics is something that takes over your TV yes. on multiple stations. Sure. And we know it comes every four years. The okay. Summer Olympics is a big that, deal. That's I agree. a lie because I purposely watched Batman. <laughs> Did I say it right that time? <laughs> I purposely watched it just for Snoop Dogg's commentary. It's hilarious. <laughs> It was the, it was the best part about the Olympics to me. So there's far. a there's a prime example. He would have never watched. And this it. is why you're not a dude. <laughs> <laughs> because I, you can enjoy Snoop Dogg, but to say it's the best part of the Olympic Games, I, like, it wasn't I the mean, best. I, right, I, I'm exaggerating. Is, exactly, which okay. is the, something that not a dude does. <laughs> Okay, it's just like that exaggeration. Every dude in the city rolled their eyes like this, man. Like he ain't even enjoying the goat Simone Biles, which he just said five I minutes ago. He right. watched for yep. now it's because Snoop Dogg mm-hmm. is talking about it. Yeah, this well, Snoop Dogg. Listen, Snoop Dogg is there. He's the village idiot. He's the court jest. He's the Joker in the deck. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. He dresses he's the, up with Martha Stewart to watch the equestrians go, right. but you know, which he would and, never do. That. And that's fun to right. hire somebody to be a mascot of the games. I'm all for it. But this math got to be wrong. Five hundred thousand dollars, maybe for the trip. Maybe sure. Let, take care of all of his expenses and give him five hundred grand to come and enjoy the Olympics. That makes more sense than five hundred thousand dollars a day. But he's gone for two weeks. I don't think. I think he would turn down five hundred thousand dollars for two weeks at the Olympics. Maybe it is. But they're right. paying for everything. Yeah. So I mean, it's like you get all this Olympic clothes, you get all of the stuff taken care of. Yeah. You're just running around doing correspondent work, which isn't heavy lifting. So give him a couple of maybe days of five hundred. But if you if you make it five hundred thousand dollars a day, that's seven. Million. I ain't pocket watching, but so, God. Yeah. So I, I'm seeing some text out of the eight six three. It says. Not that uh, Snoop Dogg is the reason why I watched, but I do follow him seeing what he's doing during the Olympics. Yeah, that, he's, that's he makes a it social media pact for him to promote the Olympics. Fine, sure, but I'm just saying seven mil, five hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah, for Snoop Dogg to run around and be like, oh, look at that, look at that Snoop, look, <laughs> hey, look at that horse nephew. He doing the snoop a loop like <laughs> yo, like, <laughs> he crip yeah. walking. And he's still out there, right? Yeah, yeah he's still yeah. there. Would you leave if you paid you five hundred thousand dollars a day? So no. if they're been going one, two, three, that's four, seven mil. Five, six, Don't hate Orlando. Seven, 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 seven. But, yeah, he's been he made six mil so far. I thought but, it was seven mil for two weeks. I mean, if he's making five hundred thousand dollars a day, I mean, bro, like, <laughs> that's incredible. That's a lot. I, I can't believe it. And but I will say, I do enjoy seeing him out there. Um, whether he's getting paid that much at all, they got to keep this up. It's been super entertaining. He's definitely the court gesture. I, I agree with you. <laughs> they just said Snoop Dogg is the announcer for the Hunger Games. <laughs> I mean, listen, I, I I enjoy me some Snoop. I yeah. like seeing him run around with Martha. Oh, yeah. So I'm wondering, is Martha getting $500,000 a getting day? She's getting paid to go out there. I mean, I like seeing them together. They do stuff, at, you know, in they a bundle. Ha- she has to be getting paid as much or if not more. And the fact that they dressed up together to match one another, it just elevated the situation. Uh, don't be a hater. Oh, Rich, I agree. Snoop is a good spokesperson. He is. Yeah, he's he's great. entertaining. Have Listen. you ever seen a better spokesperson for something like this? I Only mean, because of his, like, you know how like, when he does the animation, yeah. uh, the voice stuff for the animals? Of course, yeah. And he's like, Oh, look at that muskrat. Cussing <laughs> and stuff. That's yeah. the only, like, if he wasn't cussing and being Snoopy, yeah. it wouldn't be the same. Mm-hmm. And it's like, and now you got the Olympics where he just run around eating. You know, like croissants uh-huh. and whatever. It's like, okay, they I need, get it. They I need to do it. like a segment of Snoop going and trying to sleep in the Olympic bags because I heard that's been a huge problem over there. Because yeah. they, like, yeah, because they're taller. Yeah, there's yeah. a there was a gold a picture bags. of the gold medalist from Italy. He's sleeping on the floor outside on the grass because he's saying he that the conditions mm-hmm. of his bed were so bad. That the they also sucks. make you, um, like most people would understand, if they get a gold medal, they were like, all right, now I can turn up and enjoy Paris. Right, right. They send you home. What? They send you home. After you're done? After you're done. 
Yeah, because like the one of the one of the surfer guys was on with TMZ, and they're like, "What are you doing here?" And he's like, "Well, they send you home afterwards because you have other people who are competing in the in. Per- in the room next to you, right? And you're p- staying up all night because your games are over now. So wow. now you're partying and you're enjoying yourself, which is not what they want you to do because they don't want you to keep the other people up." So you have other people who still got to get up and you that know. That totally perform. makes sense, though. Yeah. So you, so you got to send you got to you got to send people home, or either they got to go to their own like out of the village. Yeah. But they're done with the games after their final game, and they get their award and everything else. It's time for you to go because you're going to be the distraction. Bro, you got me messed up. If I trained all these years uh-huh. to get into the Olympics and I can't even enjoy it myself. After well, I mean, I'm done? And, and they, I mean, you could come back or whatever. If you're going like some some of the big stars got their own private like suites and stuff mm. they can go do their thing there but like if you're on that olympic boat yeah like where you're just floating around and you're a cabin next to cabin they're like nah. no no not at all you have no. to leave and you got to be back for the closing ceremonies sure you know so it's like they're probably it's staying like, off they're campus. just staying off campus so they could just keep you know them the people who have to compete focused yeah i was yeah. watching rock climbing yesterday i've never been more entertained did you ever? Did you watch see the rock climbing? See, it sounds silly. I saw it. There's, but you watch it. I was there's like, rock climbing. Like we having a rock climbing team. A rock climbing contest Dude, between two two people. Just, it's like a bunch of Spider Man. Yeah, just climbing up this wall so fast. It was well. I know it sounds silly until you watch it, and they get up top in like Don't five give seconds. Me that look. <laughs> it was really cool. I, I, like, I wasn't was giving awesome. you the look. I was giving both of y'all the look. I'm saying, hey, listen. I used to. Rock I, was, I watched some Olympics. Yeah. But I watched the Olympics. Now, if Snoop was, I don't watch. If I don't watch. The, I don't watch the wannabe games. I watch the Olympic games. That's not the wannabe games. No, I don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's some wannabes. Let me tell you something. I'm American <laughs> through and through. Uh-huh. I, red, white, and blue, I'm with you. But I'm not going to sit and watch certain games. What? Like rock climbing? That's cool. Nah. It doesn't rock sound cool until awesome. you watch it. I, that's fine. But I'm just saying, I can enjoy rock climbing, but I'm not. No. Are you I watch- only got a certain amount of time to watch the Olympics. Yes. I'm not going to watch the rock climbing. I'm not going to watch the break dancing. Are you not I'm at not all? Gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna watch it. The hell, I'm gonna they watch that. That's the one thing with folks. the music in it. Yeah. Great. I live music. Well, the like, question, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on, that. bro. I, just, I see you pop lock every day. I mean, I don't need to see that. <laughs> I, I don't want to see You don't even record. watch ping pong? Like, that's a. I watched like one dude. I, but I, I couldn't. I couldn't tell you anybody. He wasn't. I, it was, I don't even think Olympic is. I don't even think U, USA had anybody competing when I watched it. It was just watching it just to catch it because it was on. Uh-huh. And that's it. I keep it on in the office where I say I catch something every now and then, yeah. whatever. But I, nah. Yeah. After I'm Forrest good. Gump retired, he was like, I'm not watching. This I, right. Yeah. I'll tell right. you something. I became a, a fan of that shooting and the way that they stand. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> Shooting the gun. They're just there like this. <laughs> and then you got the you one. Look that, like a drunk uncle. <laughs> <with a gun. laughs> but that's how they stand. They, they over here just like. And then you got the one guy from Turkey that's just everybody else got that's to do equipment. with the white shirt. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he just walked out there looking like he yeah. just got off of Winnebago. Everybody got like scopes <laughs> on their head. They got all the like this whole like Garb. get up. Yeah. And, and this guy from Turkey come out here with glasses. He's just like. <laughs> that dude looked like he had just ate nachos. Yeah. He did. He looked like he had his nacho cheese. He's just like, <laughs> he's like, like I don't either. even want to be here, dog. They just told me I could shoot things. Just, like he don't look like he trained at all, oh and he's God. good. Yeah, but he got silver. Yeah, he's good, but he's That's like awesome. that man looked like he is just out here, just like hanging. He's just like, I heard that they had a gate that was open, so I just walked through it. Oh Next thing God. I know, they handed me a gun. That's crazy. That's what it is. Yeah, all, all, right. these, all these off games or, um, that you wouldn't necessarily enjoy, like rock climbing last night, I never thought I would enjoy it, and it was super entertaining. Nah. And hey, hey, you know what? With the whole controversy with the boxing, too, because I was watching because of that, because I was actually intrigued after that whole story came out, mm-hmm. after that uh, Amine uh, Khalif, mm-hmm. and everybody was saying that you know she was a man. Well, she and has she a male actually, chromosome. But she, no, she doesn't. Yes, she does. You gotta get the. You gotta get the facts. They, it, she was a, born a biological woman, and people were on the internet she has a male chromosome. calling her Listen, a stranger. I, the woman is a woman. I mean, she's not an attractive woman, but she's a woman. <laughs> she Let has her a live, male Mary. chromosome. She, wow. Listen, because they probably she. It's sipped, like a one in a million she sipped bajillion. Some muscle tea. It's an oddity. Right. She sipped something. It's true. I mean, listen. What? The woman, I read all about it last the woman night. I educated myself. Looks like something extra. We know that. Yes. But she was born a biological woman. With 
an extra chromosome. She was not. Right. That's that. See, that was the thing, though. Nobody really knows if she has an extra chromosome. They, they just tested said that her blood. She failed a gender eligibility test in 2023. Which tells you what? No, that she had elevated. She failed self- it. Yeah. I don't know why, but she failed it. She but failed I mean, it. when I'm looking at her, I'm like, I can kind of see. <laughs> she, she had elevated <laughs> testosterone. I mean, but it's, no, not, it's not. But it's, listen, it, it is what it is. We all see her. Yeah. I'm not gonna make jokes. The thing is, though, anymore. She, <laughs> she trained like everybody else. She trained like everybody else. Maybe she did fail a gender eligibility test, but it could be just because she had a heightened testosterone levels. Yeah, she and was now, sipping on some of that tea. I told you, when the muscle teas, when you sipping on it, teas. you had mess around if and I flunk drank a some test. Muscle milk. Yeah, <laughs> she probably drank some of that muscle milk. She stopped by the Seven Eleven in Paris uh-huh. and drank an extra muscle milk. Next thing you know, she had an extra chromosome. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you look at it, can you, you can see the chromosome. I can lean that way. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can see it. Like, I, yeah, see I can see it bit. right across her forehead. I'm like, that got that chromosome right there. <laughs> Orlando and the Freak Show. Seven Deadly Spirits.